And your boy that hell just came in. I looked by my, opened my door and I looked out my door and started hitting me in my head. I took out run and ran to my restroom and then I called my mama. To And then a mountain shower on Sunday. The rest of us will clear out only 54, though. Bone chilling. <laughs> Next week, dry as a bone. You're up. I'm meteorologist Lisa Van Sy. So you definitely need to be careful. Don't go outside. We are watching the uh, storms. And, and Alex, we're in the dark right now. Yeah, I was just about to say. Chris and Dr. Forbes are on the Global Forecast Center, and it appears that we've lost power. Yeah, yeah, we, uh, we, uh, we know that the thunderstorms are coming right over top of us. We presume we've uh, had a little bit of a lightning strike. Uh, typically, we'll go to generator power, uh, but uh, we may have uh, had some circuit within the building, perhaps, that control the lights here that have been knocked out. That's Just true. leave it at that. She's got quite the uterus. I'll just say that much. <laughs> Satellite radar shot this morning. You're just saying, I know you, you, I can't believe you said that. <laughs> All right, satellite radar. <laughs> Clear skies, 73. That's what her husband said to you. <laughs> 73. <laughs> 92, such a hot human. We got to get serious because we got the news to do. Back to Natalie? I knew something was wrong when a little pretty white girl ran into a black man's arms. Something is wrong here. Dead giveaway. Dead Charles, giveaway. Charles, thank you very Dead much. Dead giveaway. Thank you very much for your time. And either she homeless or she got problems. That's the only reason why she ran into a black man. Charles, thank, thank you for being there, man. They could get a new poop pope sooner than expected. There's just six shots of espresso in there. The study's being published today in the Annals of Neurology. There's still plenty of time to take part in our last Stuff a Butt, a Bus event of the season. Let's get the Fox Eyes Linda Schmidt, who's live at Gracie Mansion tonight, where the family will be shitting, sitting Shiva tomorrow, Linda. Illegal butt injections. I'm Luann Kahn with the NBC 10 Investigators. Who am I chasing? So, so. And Hugh Janus turning 10. We'd mentioned. I'm sorry. What? What? I'm sorry. It's, it's one of those. It's one of those. Oh, <laughs> I, I totally felt more than that. Especially when you're talking to young classical penis, pianists. Right there in the middle of your screen. Um, and you can see there are that one dog is is uh, chained up right now. Some 2,200 passengers are being blown on charter flights from the Bahamas to Maryland with a promise of a full refund and a future cruise. For $64, a professional instructor will take you for a three-hour heart-pounding lap ride. Uh, 190 <laughs> A three-lap ride. Three-lap ride, thank you. <laughs> Not a lap ride. <laughs> <laughs> Four hundred ninety-nine dollars. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> you can read them on the street. <laughs> I hear Dave, but I don't hear on air. Well, of course, there's nothing on air. Maybe that's why we don't hear anything. There's, there's no audio on air. What do you mean there's no audio on air? Because it's just the radar. What's happened to audio? Well, because we aren't we aren't usually on at this time. There's nothing usually on. It's nothing like, is on the station? We're in sign-off sign mode at this time. I didn't even realize we ever signed off. Good morning. How are you That's doing? That's Lily. She's our new grad. Lily new and I go way back, so don't worry about Lily. Let me tell you about Lily. Okay, right, Lily? To pull this table up because they can see it in the shot now. Those Sorry. bastards. Multiple cars in the Fox 9 parking lot right now. With every car? Including mine? All right. Uh, every car in the Fox 9 parking lot, including mine, is now without a windshield. A little bit of everything. Oh, my gosh. Come on, Gordo. Come no, I can't. Oh, my God. This is Helga. Come touch her. Oh, my God. Oh my God. Here's the big pic. Excuse me, big picture. 
We've all had the hiccups before, right? Cy Cypress to Copperfield as well. 536, excuse me. Scattered showers and a couple of th thunderstorms during the overnight. Uh, compared to heavy rain, <laughs> excuse me, re record low temperatures. <clears throat> Mostly clear, huh? Oh, my broom is backwards. Oh, that was on purpose. I don't get much practice at being a witch. Here we go. As we scan across. Oh! <laughs> Same-sex marriage is legal in New Mexico. The high court says it will wait until the issue makes its way through the lower courts. Linda Carson, ABC7, would you not eat my pants? Ah! <laughs> At the uh, Community Shield game, uh, I'm not going to get in trouble. It worked in practice. Like, <laughs> but any nor'easter grinds up the sand. And Barbell. And rebuilt from the ground up. I don't think that teacher should be allowed back at school. In Lake Station, Indiana, Roseanne Antaeus. I think as of right now, listening to all of the fans and uh, fans behind me, um, they don't uh, really care about that at this point. This is the season that matters. And despite the fact that they've had such a tremendous amount of sex during the re during of success during the re regular season. I feel like A&M is going to do a great job because Johnny just got the highest man. This is why I like it. you. This is why I like you very much. <laughs> you, like you yeah, very these much. are high high minded fans for sure. <laughs> yes. Uh, for sure. What do you think about the game? I'm, I'm all for yeah. Oh my. Oh gosh, you guys, you oh guys my. we are live. Giga Maggie. All right. Well, Giga. We, are going, yes. we are going to win. We have always been great in this, like, SEC. We have been great in the SEC. We have, like, definitely found our spot in the SEC, so we're going to win. Oh, you have nothing on us. Come on, y'all. I could not have said it any better. <laughs> Olivia Gondak. It, it says that I wanted to eat her pussy. Olivia Gondak. I've never said that in my life to her. I would never do that. I'm happily married. I've got more than enough to eat at home. Thank was you very there much. Was anything that was true? <laughs>